Hello everyone, today I prepared for you a fantastic tutorial on how to get started with PHP. And the truth is that from the start I'm sorry for my weak humor, but today my friend, my best friend, lied to me and it's right in the eyes. I don't know why people lie, what they afraid of. This is the human element that different us from the animals. I don't know. It is really sad. And it's nothing you or I can do about that. That is life. Okay, it's not my business, let's get started. I will only show you how to download and install your software. Because I have to go out and I'm just thinking that if the tutorial will be shorter, then better I can get to you. Okay, so far so good, right? <laughs> Today we have 1st of October and I decide to create a small tutorials to help you understand uh, PHP. Of course our first step will be definitely download software and we can download them in uh, several ways. Uh, for example we can use menu, software manager and waiting and waiting and oh that's it typing something here or menu and packages manager and waiting okay typing something here we can close it but we are professionals and we use console in Linux first of all we need to type sudo because installing anything on Linux must be installed with the rules of the root and the root is almost the same like the administrator on Windows then apt minus get install if you wanna something remove from the system, just type remove and the name of software, but be very careful what you wanna delete. Let's get back. Install. First of all will be a page 2. I can of course download it now and again enter the formula of the next software, but we are professionals and we all type in the same command line just using the space. Second, PHP 5. Third, PHP my admin. Fourth will be PHP 5 MySQL. Fifth will be MySQL server. And the last one will be lib page 2 mod out MySQL. Press enter. Now we need to enter the password. When the software will download at the background we can see what's happening in the world. Ah, uh, nothing interesting. Ok, so now that we have already downloaded and installed the software, see if working properly. Open your favorite web browser, type localhost. Ok, it's working, it's working, it's working! Now I quickly show you how to change the index file. We take our console and write sudo and pluma because this is a text editor. Now we go to appropriately folder slash var slash www slash and take index.html and you see it's our index file let's change it by typing a smile save it refresh browser and in a split second we see change for the better it's working it's working it's working okay that's it and see you soon 